Coop. Great game by the guys, but unfortunately the Gulf Coast able to rally and pick up the big win there at the end. Talk about the game tonight, just sort of how you thought it went. Well, I really thought, really proud of our kids for the effort they gave tonight. Uh, maybe ran out of gas there a little bit at the end. Gulf Coast depth probably got to us. And they're number one for a reason. They're 19 and four for a reason. They got a really good team and uh, they deserve to win, but taking nothing away from our kids. I thought it was just a tremendous effort tonight. We take a look at some of the guys scoring wise tonight. You look uh, talk about some of the guys, some of the sophomores that sort of stepped up big tonight as well. Well, you, you know, Ewing's freshman. I thought he played really well. Thought uh, Trey, you know, finally had a, a good game inside for us. And of course, his last game for Nick and Morris, and they got in there and battled and got in foul trouble. Both of them uh, uh, playing the second half basically in foul trouble the whole way, and that didn't help us at all either. Well, Coop, you talk about the last games. This. End of an era here at ICC, your final game. Uh, unfortunately, not able to go out a winner here, but just talk about your season, your career, and your time here at ICC. Well, obviously, this year is a little disappointing as far as the wins go, but you know, for the guys to make the tournament with a lot of freshmen and to give a great effort tonight against the number one team, I'm proud of that. And really proud of what Jennifer and I have been able to do along with the help of Dr. Cole and the whole administration from where the program was in 98 to where it is now. And, we feel like uh, we've made it a little bit better and hopefully uh, bigger and better things come for ICC basketball in the future. Well, Coop came to a much shorter end than we hope, but thanks for the memories and I look forward to seeing you around campus. Thank you.